Uh, I think people don't come to help because they don't feel they have the time. They're too busy. But I think when people come, the, come or not come, it's not because they're prejudiced, it's because they feel they don't have time. And when they do decide they have time and they do want to help somebody, they have in their mind who they want to help, what kind of person. What we do here is we recruit volunteers, citizen volunteers, and we match them one to one or in a in a group uh, to help other people who have a handicap. And we help people uh, no matter what handicap they have. They could be intellectually handicapped, have a mental illness, a physical handicap. Uh, they could be demuni, they could be uh, pov uh, ha ha live in poverty, they could be a single parent, whatever. So we, we don't generally turn anybody away. I saw an ad in the newspaper asking for a volunteer to uh, conduct an acrylic class. And that's exactly what I do is acrylic painting. So I volunteer, and I was accepted as a volunteer. And I've enjoyed it for the last nine years. El mismo asiento y ese cristal demolido y una canción. are a voluntary organization, so it's very important to the organization to work with volunteers. But the, the most important thing about what we do is our clientele and our protégés, the people that we help. Because our volunteers are wonderful. We have over 420 matches right now in the West Island. So we have, uh, some people have more than one advocate. They have more than one volunteer. So we have almost 400 people who are handicapped, who have a friend. They're not paid. They don't have to go like the CLSC once a week. They go because they want to be there. They go because they want to help, and they want to be a friend. Uh, the first gentleman that I worked with, uh, he died, and he was severely handicapped physically. The man had been a, an engineer in his work, and as a process of physical ailments, he was in a wheelchair. All I had to do was go to his house, put him in the wheelchair, which, by the way, he had a lift, you know, to pick him up and put him in the thing. We would go to the shopping center, walk around, you know, maybe talk to some people, and that was it. That, that was my, my activity with him. Well, one thing I would recommend to anybody is no matter how little knowledge you do have about subject, you don't realize how much you do have. So never be afraid to volunteer because volunteer work is so rewarding for you and for the people receiving it, no matter how deep your talent is. Por 
el espacio que era para mí no pago más aquí acojo historias santas de partir